What were you doing 20 years ago? Maybe you were listening to Beyonce, Crazy in Love, or 50 Cent, In the Club, which were top radio hits in 2003. Maybe you weren't even born yet. Or just maybe you had $1,000 to invest and you bought shares in in a little fruit company called Apple. Well, if you did lay down the 1,000 greenbacks, you'd be sitting pretty today with over a million dollars. That's 1,000x or 1,000 times your initial money. One click on the buy button and boom, a mountain of money. Okay. I don't mean to make it sound so stupid easy, because it's not that easy to pick a winner like Apple. But I was reading an article from 2003 about Apple that blew me away. And there was a statement in the article that made me think that Apple was, at that point, unusually cheap for those who knew how to read financial statements and understand accounting concepts. The article said that Apple was worth $15 per share and yet had $11 in cash inside the balance sheet. Well, that makes the net cost of the stock something closer to $4 for the rest of the stuff like property, plant, equipment, and intellectual property. And also, the article says they were expected to make something like $0.35 per share, which on $15 for the stock is a 65 PE price to earnings, but compared to the cash adjusted price of $4, the PE was closer to 11. Keep in mind that those numbers are before Apple split many times and the split adjusted price back then is more like 20 cents and Apple today is over $200. Apple had already come out with the iPod two years earlier and sales were growing double digits every year. iPhone would come out in four more years, so the growth would continue. Apple had multiple points when it was financially cheap and could have provided entry points, like in 2008 during the Great Recession or in 2018 when Warren Buffett bought his position for Berkshire Hathaway. The lesson here is that if we can find value stocks with low risk, good things can happen for many years after if we bought a good business. Dig deeper into the stocks you are tracking and you might uncover hidden value and great opportunities. Like and follow and let me know what stocks you are tracking.